Imagine being able to turn your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4 or 5 into a mobile office, complete with a stand, keyboard, mouse, and stylus. That's exactly what the Miwato adjustable stand can do. Let's check it out. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. BTM here, and today I'm gonna show you how I use the Miwato for Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4 or 5 as a portable computer system. This is a set of accessories that include a folding bracket, a keyboard, a mouse, and a capacitor pin. It is very compatible with Samsung Galaxy Z Fold series, which are foldable smartphones that can transform into a tablet. Now, I bought this set for Amazon for about $93, and I've been using it now for a few weeks. First of all, let me show you what's in the box. You get the folding bracket, which is made of aluminum alloy and has a 360 degree rotation. You can adjust the angle and height of your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold devices to suit your needs. It also has a rubber pad on the bottom to prevent slipping and scratching. The bracket is very sturdy and stable and it can hold your device in both the portrait and landscape modes. Next, you get the Bluetooth keyboard which is also made of aluminum alloy and it has a sleek design. It has a QWERTY layout with function keys and shortcut keys. It connects to your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold device via Bluetooth. And it has a rechargeable battery that lasts for about 60 hours of use. The keyboard is very responsive and comfortable to type on. Then you get a Bluetooth mouse which is also made of aluminum alloy and has a smooth surface. It has a scroll wheel and two buttons and it connects to your device via Bluetooth as well. You need to buy an extra battery for it because it's not included in the package. The mouse is very precise and easy to use and it works well on different surfaces. Finally, you get the capacitor pin which is a stylus that you can use to write, draw, or navigate your Samsung devices. It has a fine tip that mimics the feel of a real pen, and it works with any capacitive touch screen. It also has a pen holder attached to the keyboard so you can store it securely when not in use. The pen is very handy and convenient, especially if you want to take notes or sketch something on your device. So, how do I use this set as a portable computer system? Well, it's very simple. I just unfold my Samsung Galaxy Z Fold device into the tablet mode. I place it on the folding bracket. I pair it with a keyboard and mouse via Bluetooth and I use the capacitor pin as needed. And boom shakalaka, I have a mini laptop that I can use anywhere I want. I can work on documents, presentations, or emails with ease. I can browse the web, watch videos, or play games with fun. I can even use some apps that are optimized for the Samsung Z Fold device, such as Microsoft Office. The best part is that this set is very lightweight and compact. It comes with a cloth storage bag that you can use to carry everything around. So what are the pros and the cons of this set? Well, here are some pros. It is very versatile and functional. You can use it as a stand-alone phone stand or as a portable computer system. It's very durable and high quality. The material are solid and well made. It's very easy and convenient to use. The setup is quick and simple. It's very affordable and cost effective. You get four accessories for less than $100. And here are some of the cons. 
the mouse needs an extra battery that's not included in the package. The keyboard and mouse may not be compatible with other devices besides the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold series. The capacity pin may not be as accurate or sensitive as the S Pen that comes with the Samsung devices. However, overall, I think that it is a great accessory for anyone who owns a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold device. It enhances the functionality and usability of your device and gives you more options and flexibility. It's like having a phone, a tablet, and a laptop in one device. Now, if you found this video to be helpful and informative, please give me a thumbs up. It helps the channel and subscribe so you get my next video when it comes out. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Thanks for watching. Now, if you did like this video or if you didn't like this video, I'm sure you're going to like this other one up here.